Hello everybody, welcome back with a new video. So today we will speak, basically I will answer the questions that I got from you. Some of you asked me, please show me how to set up the flam booster properly and not get some DB loss. Okay, the right way is, this is your antenna. Miguel antenna, rack antenna, whatever DBI she have. Here just for presentation I use the 3 DBI antenna and use it your antenna this is the antenna under the antenna you must to use lightning arrester but me i don't recommend lightning arrester i recommend to use a cavity filter because cavity filter have two jobs he filter the signal and he can work as a lightning arrester also so imagine in this situation this is a cavity filter okay just for demonstration after you put antenna, a cavity filter, enter, and behind the cavity filter, a ground him put your ground here. And from the cavity filter, use a connector basically. Use this type of connector, SMA male to N type male, to connect him under the antenna. And from here, you put connect him to your flam booster or a casson booster or any type of amplifiers and in this situation we are using the flam booster he the 10 dbi the latest one this is made specifically for helium okay have just 10 dbi like this you not get so much invalid when you use him and here as you can see the rx he represents the green color he already on and takes he represent when he beacon basically when he send a beacon and you will see here a red line for five seconds and after he go away okay you have two options to power this i will show you how to install it and now show you the option how to power it like we said antenna cavity filter cavity filter should be grounded from the side and from the cavity filter use an adapter basically as n type male to sma male and from there to your flam booster or any type of amplifier make sure to make this waterproof cover him properly and from there under the amplifier use the alamar 400 and from the alamar this black cable represent the alamar 400 and the end of the cable use a DC injector this is a DC injector from jet vision as all of you know him this is the base by ST 5 volt he come like you know me I use everything from the same company like this the devices work smoothly and from the by ST use a jump cable or pigtail so I use SMA male Basically here it the connector is wrong, but you use a pigtail connect him SMA female to IPX, okay? SMA female, not male, to IPX. Why IPX? Basically this is represents your minor. Open your minor. In the RF cards you will find the IPX port. Remove him and put this cable. Like this you will have signal directly from your RF card to your DC injector, from your DC injector, Alamar 400, flam booster for example, connector, antenna. You will have the minimum of the minimum DBI loss. 0 0.5 here, you will recover her if you use this because you will not use the other cable that come with the miner. Yeah, simple as that. Some of you use the amplifier inside the home basically you don't need the bias t when you use this amplifier next to your minor if you put your minor directly connected if we imagine amplifier inside your home next to your minor so connect the minor to the amplifier directly and to give power to both of them you have to do like this I build the cable this is the cable who come with your minor yeah 
with this cable he give you 5 volt to make on your miner like me I have like wireless miners this is the cable come basically this is a raspberry pi power line I cut it in the middle because you have 3 volt and 5 3 amps and 3 5 point a 5.1 volt just to be sure he will give power to both of them I not recommend this I must to give power to each one of them but this is the option catch the power line cut it in the middle connect the red with the red the black with the black red represent the plus the black represent the minus like this your miner he will have power with this USB-C and your flambooster he will have power from the same cable also this will have 5 volt this will have 5 volt this is will be a little bit pressure on your power line but it's still option and he will save you 65 euros if you have two power lines like this extra or you have a phone charger just read the specs how much volt he have how much amp he have connect the red with the red the black with the black and like this you have one power line to power your miner one power line to power your flam booster this is the best way but if you are curious how to combine them this is simple cut here plus plus minus minus okay antenna cavity filter connector flam booster alamar 400 dc injector pigtail and miner this is the best setup and here you have to cut the skywall and waterproof everything if you want to use this inside the home I already said so from the short video I show you I put the flam booster basically I put it on top of the Gramos walker yeah some of you as you don't know this is high high receiver you know this is he focus only on rx he have 10 dbi of gain only rx gain and he have a tx bypassed some of you don't understand this basically if you if we make a test here if i make send i will have basically say 20 gateways yeah that's mean when i send a beacon 20 gateways that they hear my beacon if I put the flam booster on top of it and I send a beacon, I will get a 10 gateways or 20 gateways like I get before. You tell me why you're supposed to get more. No, the flam booster, uh, the glamos, he sent a beacon. So this is TX test. If you have another amplifier like Akasom who have extra 6 dBi, then you will get here even more witness. That's mean you are beaconing more than 14 dBi and you are getting more witnesses from your amplifier but this he amplify only tx uh, only rx not tx so if you witness in this location with your uh, glamos if you put if you click send you have 20 witness you use the uh, this one he will give you 20 witness and you will be oh that's mean my amplifier doesn't work no he work but he work with the rx not tx and for uh, glamos glamos he sent beacons we are testing with tx not with rx okay just to keep that in mind and you can use this device to know how much ongifier let's mean how much gateways you are able to witness but at this moment you will not get the same result okay for example if you make tests with glamos walker and you will find 20 with uh, 20 devices they hear your beacon and you put your helium miner here in the same location same antenna you will not get 20 gateways you will get maybe eight gateways and you tell why with the glamos i find 20 gateways and now i get just eight that's from helium people unfortunately with all my respect to helium people they reduce our power so 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 much so we not have enough dbi like we're supposed to have for European, we're supposed to have 14 dBi's. We don't have 14 dBi's. Because when I make tests with the Glamos, I'm supposed to get 30 witness, uh, 30 
30 gateways here I get just three in this location I have a friend who are in the middle of the city who had 500 witness with the same antenna of course same cable he changed nothing in his setup unfortunately now he have 138 witness from 500 you see how much they are reducing every 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 one two weeks they reduce a little bit dbi like this we not feel it in one time but as a lot of people they are already getting angry so if you are using amplifier with all my respect to helium people you are not cheating basically you are buying your power because they reduce your power how i know i test okay if you want to see how much how i test go watch my glamos video go to my playlist there is a glamos playlist and you will find a lot of videos over there so i answer the question how to set up i answer you that's mean if you are buying this not for extra this is only for people who have 14 witness already so when you send a beacon and you have a 14 witness in your list that's mean you need the amplifier like this you don't need extra tx if you are sending a beacon and you don't have a 14 witness in your list then you don't need this amplifier he will not help you you need another amplifier who have extra dbi like extra 5 db or extra 6 db and this will help you to get more witnesses i hope you make the difference okay if you still have more question let me know when i am free i will answer your question so and some of you put me immediately now comment tell me eh, glamos is for the knob or trambuster for the knob man you always put this comment over there just watch the videos to understand I make this short video just to show you this will not add any extra witnesses in your when you beacon so now I put a second video just to explain all of this okay he know himself who put this comment I already delete him because it's stupid comment okay stay happy stay stay patient with helium of course <laughs> and I wish you the best Okay, you look nice. I love playing with helium stuff. <laughs> okay, I see you in the next one. Bye.